Yo, tell them about the time that you crank called Gabe as homicide. Oh. God, who's that? I was in a car with somebody, and whoever this is better stop calling me. Um, it was the couple nights before the All Japan Ring of Honor show, Final Battle 2003, I think. Mm -hmm. 2004, 2003. And um, I guess I do a pretty good homicide impersonation. So um, you can imagine over the phone, over a cell phone, it probably sounds all that much better. So uh, I was in the car with somebody who had a New York number. And we were driving to a show or from a show. And they're like, I was doing the homicide. And they're like, yo, you should crank call Gabe. So I do. I crank call Gabe. He answers the phone. And I was all, yo, it's D. And he's like, hey, D, what's up? He's like, yo, you know, um, you know how I am Puerto Rico. Um, and he was, and D was, he was in Puerto, Puerto Rico, Rico that, week, that week before. He's like, listen, man, you know, I want to thank you. You know, I love Ring of Honor. You, you, you know, you do great things for my career. Um, but they want to push me. They put the belt on me. They promise a lot of money. Uh, and I'm going on and on. And Gabe's all, well, so what? what? Yeah, good, good for you, good. I, you know, I want you to make money, blah, blah, blah. Man, I, I got to cancel off the All Japan show. And I know, you know, like it's my dream to wrestle Kojima. I think, you know, I thank you, Gabe. I thank you for, you know, but I, I got to do what's, I know, I got to raise my kid, my son. I got to do that. And Gabe is now, I mean, I can hear Gabe's heartbeat, you know. I, and I just keep pouring it on and saying, like, the most ridiculous words, you know. I, I'm sorry, Gabe. You know, all Japan, Kojima, Lariat, Lariat, Lariat. You know, I know, you know, I just, the money is too good and they want me to stay and I don't have to pay rent. They're going to buy my food. You know, it's it's warm down here. And I'm going on and on and on. And Gabe, Gabe is just freaking out. Finally, what, 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 what do you mean? What? Yeah, I mean, did, wait, you, you, no, I mean, it's, it's Kojima. I know it's Kojima. And I just keep going on. I mean, he, I hear Gabe's, like, heartbreaking, you know, like, like arteries exploding. Sorry, a few days out from the show. We can't possibly... You I, know, I, I just don't understand this. It's just... <laughs> So finally, I'm like, yo, you know this isn't homicide. And Gabe's not even listening at this point. He's like, D, you, you can't do that. You got to do that. Yeah, the CM Punk, I just fucking with you. <laughs> you know? And I carried on for that about another two minutes until finally Gabe goes, wait, what? It's like, yo, and I didn't even use my real voice. So I was like, yo, it's Punk. I'm in the car with so-and-so. We're going to the show. <laughs> I'm like, I totally got you. You thought Homicide was canceling. Coach. And Gabe is now just livid. Like, when Gabe gets really, really pissed, oh, he screams great. like a woman. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> He's, like, going nuts. And finally, he, like, hung up on me. And then I didn't see him until, like, the show. He was like, you motherfucker. He was like, he was like I had a fucking heart attack. He's like, I didn't know what to do. That was one of our main events. And I, uh, Gabe, um, I've seen throw a temper tantrum oh. many, many times. You don't understand. If man, if we we should have a camera backstage to show you the fits that Gabe throws at ROH shows and stuff doesn't go right. Like especially if it's like lighting cues or music isn't hit at the right time. Oh, oh my God, the clipboards that have that have been punished. I watched him whip uh, because the FIP shows since it's in like an after bar, like the place is all clean and nice, and they have all the ashtrays stacked up on one table, and I saw him one by one take every single ashtray and whip it against the wall until it, we, like, we're knee deep in like just ashtray plastic. <laughs> and, it, it, you know, it's not fucking hard to fucking, he fucked up the whole show! And even Sal, the guy who owns the promotion, is like, eh, there's only 15 people out there, who cares, you know? And he, it's a DVD product! And I think he's freaking <laughs> out and screaming and just breaking shit, and there's a vein in his head that looks like it's gonna it's burst. Awesome. Oh, it's tremendous. Ah, tremendous. Like, that, that's part of the show. It's like, you know, the guys like the guys will watch a little bit of the show, but they also, like, are always have one eye on Gabe for that moment if there is, like, a big, like, production fuck-up. There's been a bunch of times where, hey, Gabe's having a temper tantrum. Yeah, yo, everybody I don't know how many times I've been in the locker room, room, and it's been like, Gabe's having a temper tantrum, and everybody runs out to the hallway to go watch it. It's great. <laughs> Motherfucking cocksucking light guy fucking 